This is quietly a huge deal. Tar Logic researchers have found an alleged undocumented backdoor in Chinese manufacturer Espressif's ESP32 microchip used in more than 1 billion devices for Wi Fi and Bluetooth connectivity. Quoting Bleeping Computer. The undocumented commands allow spoofing of trusted devices, unauthorized data access, pivoting to other devices on the network, and potentially establishing long-term persistence. The researchers warned that ESP32 is one of the world's most widely used chips for Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connectivity in Internet of Things devices, so the risk is significant. In total, they found 29 undocumented commands collectively characterized as backdoors that could be used for memory manipulation, read, write, RAM, and flash, MAC address spoofing, device impersonation, and LMP LLCP packet injection. Espressif has not publicly documented these commands, so either they weren't meant to be accessible, or they were left in by mistake. The issue is now tracked under CVE 2025-27840, end quote. Now, the problem here is that the vulnerability isn't just in standard exploitation paths. It exposes systemic weaknesses at the OEM and supply chain level where trusted relationships could be weaponized. While remote exploitation via Bluetooth HCI commands theoretically exist, the real industry concern is how inconsistently Bluetooth stacks handle these commands across the ecosystem. This creates an asymmetric risk profile across products using similar components. The mention of post compromised escalation suggests a new attack vector where initial access can be leveraged into persistent hardware-level control, potentially bypassing security updates. The final point subtly acknowledges that for targeted attacks against high-value tech executives or workers, physical access vectors remain more reliable than remote exploits. <laughs> 